All right, Agent Wilson. You got it rolling, <clears throat> but you just ran into some snags. Some snags which you will, you have run into and you run into again. Your phone is on 7%, and you have plans to meet at 7 o'clock. So think about this. If you go door knocking, you guarantee that your phone will die while door knocking. Because you don't have a portable charger. Now, maybe you're saying you could leave your phone at home while you go door knocking for like the next, it's like four o'clock, two hours, four to six, two hours. But this is the thing you get important phone calls throughout the day. Like you just got the reason you even stopped to check your phone and pay attention to this was because you got an important phone call from your buyer's lender. Something to do with pushing the closing date back because of the community HOA people not being responsive and not being able to get in touch with them. So that was an important thing to know so you can do either an amendment for the future, a future date, and to let your buyer know that we're not going to close next week. So these type of things, you need to have your phone on you or you need to have a portable charger on you. You don't have a portable charger. Well, you do have a portable charger. You just don't have the connection, the connector from your phone to the charger. That's a simple fix. Actually, with the way these, it's a simple fix to get that, that extra power that you need because right now that's what you're missing you're missing some power in a lot of ways you're missing power so uh go get it and the way to go get it is yeah go meet more people you uh you marry you met like you passed out 76 business cards today the part was wrong so you, you definitely, you did four hours of prospecting. So if you do that five days a week, these houses have bigger yards. I could probably get in 500 to 1,000 contacts a week. If I had a scooter, I could do more. I could definitely get between these houses faster with a scooter. Um, so just... Just understand that you are already ahead of the game because you only have uh, uh, 300 business cards left. It's the 13th, Friday, and um, you already ordered more business cards. So what you can do now is you can make objection handling flashcards for your scripts. You can practice those and... Don't just take time off because you're not prospecting. You're practicing your scripts now. So use this time and make it productive. Yeah. Yeah, make it productive and then you'll be able to not feel like you weren't able to produce as much because you couldn't pass the business card. Because the thing is, like when you pass these business cards out, all 1,000, you're thinking right now that you're going to stop for the month. And be like, oh, yeah, I just passed out a 1000 for the month. I hit my goal. But it's like, man, I hit the goal for the month in two weeks. So if I'm doing 2000 I'll double up. I could do it in four weeks. So eventually I'll be able to close some more deals and get a listing. So I can get out of this stupid situation without with my car so I can just feel more comfortable. And in the meantime, you can just meditate on... You can meditate on... Meditate. Building the capacities. Go into the mind and fix whatever needs to be fixed. Tune up. Do a tune up for yourself. And... Be in the now. Farewell.